day six of our wolf hunt. But, uh, we still got some time left this evening. Really hard sitting here all day. Uh, two more coyotes came through this morning. I uh, shot one of them, um, but uh, that was pretty early on. So we're just still sitting here waiting. I probably shouldn't have pulled the trigger on them, but uh, it's getting kind of boring to sitting here day after day looking at nothing. But uh, I'm back to the original blind I was sitting in. Um, my hunting partner Ryan killed a wolf here a few days ago. Uh, there's still three more in that same pack and they weren't around when he shot his and there's another one yet too. It's a lone wolf that comes in here once in a while so uh, we're still watching. Hopefully we get a chance to uh, get one of these guys. I'm still pretty optimistic. Still got to check all the snares uh, Kyler's set as well about a week ago now and uh, hopefully there's something in there. But uh, anyways, this is um, uh, probably one of the most mentally difficult or challenging hunts you can do. Hopefully we've got a wolf uh, down tonight here yet. But uh, anyways, day six, there's still time. All right, last day of our hunt. We've got uh, two dead wolves on the ground for me, right there. And another one right over there, Kyler Nelson. That's got to go with. <laughs> and uh, I dare say 100% success, but pretty, uh, pretty good uh, success rate this year. Yes, sir. Give him a call. Can't right, see. Right in there. You can't right see. Go towards the light. There, there we go. go. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right on. There's uh, Ryan made this trip happen. Thanks, Ryan. This is great. I appreciate it. 100%. And we've got uh, three wolves and six days of hunting. So pretty, pretty. We did pretty good, I think. And uh, three coyotes. <laughs> <laughs> Two in one shot. Yeah.